my name's Nick Bush. Renee's being a little modest when he says he doesn't know how he became the keynote speaker. When we first planned this, for the, for the. some of us got together and wondered who it should be. And so we decided it should be the smartest. And he declined. So then we decided it should be the best looking. And he declined. <laughs> then we decided it should be the funniest. And so when we asked Renee, he figured he couldn't turn us down three times in a row. <laughs> a hand for Renee for being a good I was hired in 69 and retired in 08. The 40 years that I spent on the West Campus, I served under 10 presidents and three chancellors. And I must tell you that Ken Harper had more humanity than all the others put together. I met a young Hispanic fellow a while back and we got talking. And after a very few minutes, the subject of Pima College came up, as it does in this community. And he told me that Pima College gave me a direction, a degree, and my life. What better manifestation than that could we have for Ken Harper's vision of Pima College? And I would like to ask us to applaud ourselves for all the thousands of students that we have helped through the gift of education. Before anyone else speaks, could I make a quick announcement? Um, if anybody has not picked up a token for lunch, uh, they're out on the uh, table, and they need to know right away um, uh, what people want for lunch. So if you haven't done that and you do want to stay for lunch, go out and grab a token and they'll take care of you. Okay, do we have anyone else that wants to, and, and you don't have to come up here, there's no microphone. If you just want to stand up, identify yourself and uh, what you what your role was at Pima and, uh, and share a story or so. Anybody? Uh, Chris Sharp, you can, with all the wrinkles you might not remember me. But the thing I remember most was when I started at Pima, I was 45 years old, just finished graduate hey, Chris, school. Chris, talk a little louder. All right. When I was first started at Pima in 19...